After I'd moved down to London, after meeting up with the grapefruit at Scarborough, I then got involved with uh, Bloodwind Pig, uh, but was only with them for a few weeks, and because uh, they were off to America and Michael didn't have a passport, so Michael couldn't go and didn't have time enough to get one. Uh, so I rang Roger, and Roger says, well, you better come over to uh, stop with us at uh, Earlsfield Road, Wandsworth, which is another blog on its own. And uh, he says, you can come and uh, work with us, the grapefruit, because uh, they were a roadie down, which I did do. So we'll get into grapefruit now. Now, four-piece band initially, and the guy here was called George Alexander, which wasn't his real name. And I'll go into him later on in the vlog. There's a big surprise with this one. Then the two brothers, Pete, lead guitar, and his brother Jeff on drums, and John Purry. And that was the lineup of the grapefruit. They were actually under the wing of the Beatles. And the name, the grapefruit, came about from John Lennon, uh, who gave them the uh, name. Because at that time, John Lennon's uh, 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 wife at the time, uh, Yoko Ono, she was bringing out a brook called Grapefruit. So, aptly, they named the band Grapefruit. And they had a couple of uh, hits in the top 10, top 20, which I'll put on now and give you uh, uh, a little listen to. Videos, that is. Yeah, yeah, yeah. From the feeling 
Have a slurp of my coffee. Later on in that period of time, after them couple of hits that I'll let you listen to, they had a change of direction and they wanted to go a bit more sort of rocky fied. And uh, they brought in a, another musician called Bob Whale. Bob was fantastic. Whatever happened to Bob, I don't know. I lost track many years ago and after searching, doing relentless searches on the uh, internet, I could never find anything uh, uh, after the grapefruit uh, about Bob. But a fantastic voice. And I'm going to put a, I'm going to put this uh, video on uh, and uh, it's, it's in a German uh, club and uh, recorded in a German uh, club and it was a single that they brought out uh, at the same time they brought out the uh, LP and the LP was called Deep Water. Have a listen to this. For a period of time, the drummer Jeff Swettenham, he had a problem with a cartilage in his knee and uh, Michael was the first candidate because they'd seen me drumming with that local band so they knew I was a decent drummer and Michael jumped in readily to fill the position so finally Michael got to do radio shows, a little bit of TV while uh, Jeff was uh, recuperating. Uh, now this guy, John Purry, at the time I was with them, he was going out with a very famous model sister who eventually married uh, uh, Eric Clapton, Patty Boyd. 
Well, I'll put a photo up here now of Patty's sister uh, called Paula. And uh, Paula used to nickname me Twiggy. Mind th how things have changed. Yes, well, we'll not go into that. Now, going back to this man, George Alexander. Christened Alexander Young. Now, George did inform us that he had a brother who uh, who was in an Australian band. Many, many years, uh, George's family emigrated from Glasgow to Australia and most of his brothers and his siblings went to Australia with the family. But George and one of his sisters stayed behind. Uh, and I keep calling him George because that's what he liked to be call called. But he was actually Alex. And his brother was also called George. But his brother was called George Young. Who later became to be, after he'd left uh, the 60s uh, Australian band, who uh, had a hit. I'll put, I'll put a little clip of the hit that uh he went on to be a record producer for a band this is the surprise bit for a band his younger brothers had formed called ACDC so Alex as he was known to his family not only had his brother George who was in the music business but his youngest brothers went on Angus and I don't I don't know the other the, the other guy's name but there was two of the youngs in ACDC and uh, I have another story to tell about the northern club circuits when I used to knock around with a band called Geordie and Geordie's lead singer went on to be the lead singer in ACDC and that is Brian Johnson but that's another story right ladies and gentlemen well that's about it for this vlog I uh, hope you enjoyed uh, what I've put on that's the uh, Grapefruits Deep Water uh, album cover it was shortly after that uh, the LP wasn't much of a success and uh, the, the guys had basically played themselves out like and it was shortly after they split up by this time Michael had uh, met an American band uh, who were also living in Earlsfield Road which is another vlog as I said before and uh, Michael went off to join uh, Juicy Lucy and that's another story okay bye for now <laughs>
Come along and sing, come along and dance now Come along and throw your cares away Come along by night, come along by daytime 